Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Wake up. It's time to go to school, Jeffy. What? Riddle? Santa Claus lands here? Wait, Jeffy, we don't have time to play games or solve riddles. You have to get ready to go to school. Santa Claus lands here? What does that even mean? The fireplace, the fireplace. All right, Jeffy, I'm tired of your stupid games. It's time to go to school. Jeffy, where you at? It's the fireplace. Santa Claus lands here. He lands in the fireplace. If it's not the fireplace, where else could it be? Santa Claus lands here. Santa Claus lands the roof. Jeffy, what are you doing on the roof? I don't want to go to school. Get your ass inside the house and get ready for school. If you make me go to school, I'm jumping off the roof. <sighs> Jeffy, you're not going to jump off the roof. Bet me $5 then. I'm not going to bet you $5. Because you don't want to lose $5. No, because I don't want you jumping off the roof. Look, are you making me go to school or not? Yes. Look, Jeffy, don't you jump off that roof. If you jump off the roof, you're grounded. Literally. Wait, wait, Jeffy! 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 Are you okay? I don't know. Well, what color is my hat? Daddy, you know I don't know my colors. All right, that's kind of normal of you. Um, oh, you know what? I'm gonna call a doctor just to make sure. Well, I want my five bucks. You're not getting five bucks, Jeffy. Daddy, you bet me five dollars I wouldn't jump off the roof. I did not accept that bet. You jump off because you didn't want to go to school. Well, I still want my five bucks. All right, look, I'm gonna call a doctor and then I'll give you your stupid five bucks, all right? All right, Daddy. <sighs> then I'm giving you this bill for $10,000 for wasting my time. With $10,000? Don't call the doctor! Why? Because he's going to charge you a lot of money, and then you won't be able to give me my five bucks! Okay, look, the doctor has never charged me any money. He's my friend, okay? So, look, come on, we have to get you checked. Oh, but this time's different. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Oh, thank God you're here, doctor. My son jumped off the roof and landed on his head. Oh my God, is he dead? Uh, no. Uh, well, is he bleeding? Uh, no. Well, does he have any broken bones? Uh, I don't think so. Is he in any pain at all? Jeffy, are you in pain? No. Then what am I doing here? Well, I mean, I, I wanted you to check him because he jumped off the roof and landed on his head, so I just wanted you to check him to make sure he's okay. Okay. Hey, kid, you okay? Yeah. He's okay. Well, I just wanted you to, like, double check and make sure he didn't have, like, a concussion. He's wearing a helmet. I'm pretty sure he's fine. You know, I could be at the hospital right now saving lives, but instead I'm sitting here on your couch looking at a perfectly unharmed kid. I'm sorry for wasting your time. Yeah, me too. In fact, I'm so sorry that I'm giving you this bill for $10,000 for wasting my time. With $10,000? You've never charged me before. Well, I'm getting really tired of coming over here for stupid reasons. This wasn't a stupid reason. He jumped off the roof and landed on his head. Well, uh, he didn't get hurt, though. I mean, I bit my cheek eating breakfast this morning, but I didn't call the doctor. I just said, ow, and I kept eating, and I just chewed with the other side of my mouth. You know how it goes. You've eaten before. <sighs> I'm sorry. Yeah, well, I want my $10,000, and you can pay me right now. Well, right now? Yep. Well, I have to go to the bank and get a loan then. Okay, I'll wait. Jeffy, it looks like you're not getting your $5. Daddy, I told you this was gonna happen! Well, look, Jeffy, look, get in the car. I'm gonna drop you off at school on the way to the bank. Aww. All right, class, I got a surprise for you. No homework for the rest of the year! Yeah! No, why? The reason you guys have no homework for the rest of the year is because we did a study and we realized that homework is stressing the kids out. They don't want to do homework at home. They just want to play Fortnite. They only want to learn in school. So no homework for the rest of the year unless you guys start misbehaving and then I'm going to erase the no. So that means homework for the rest of the year. You guys got it? No homework for the rest of the year! This is the greatest day of my life! I know, Junior! It's so cool! Hey, Cody, you want to throw this ball? Yeah. No, Junior! Don't throw the ball! Why? We want to have fun. Because something bad's going to happen! Nothing bad's going to happen. Oh, give me your ball! Uh, no. Cody, throw it over Jeffy! Cody. <laughs> Uh oh! Oh! Damn it, Crass! Why you hit me in the head with a cock? Big black cock hit me right in the head! Why you do that? Damn it, Crass! Because of that! Oh! Oh! That means homework for the rest of the year! All you gotta know is fucking homework! A hundred pages of homework every single night for the rest of the fucking year! Homework for hitting me in the head with big black cock! A hundred pages of homework every night? See, Junior, I told you something bad was gonna happen! Well, Jeffy, it's all your fault! My fault? It's his fault! He's the one who threw the ball really high! 
Well, I only threw it really high because you were in the way. Yeah, Jeffy, he only threw it high because you were trying to stop us from throwing it. We were going to toss it between our desks. He was never going to throw it that high until you got in the way. <laughs> I knew this was going to happen. Well, if you knew it was going to happen, then why'd you still do it? I knew it was going to happen. I just didn't know how it was going to happen. Oh, Jeffy, you're so stupid. Just don't talk to us. But I'm trying to stop it. Hey, Dan, can you help me with my homework? Jesus Christ, Jeffy, why do you have so much homework? Because some kid threw a ball, and then the ball hit the clock, and then the clock hit the teacher in the head, and the teacher got pissed and gave us a bunch of homework. Jeffy, were you the kid that threw the ball? No. Jeffy, tell the truth. Daddy, I didn't throw the ball. I was the one who told the kid not to throw the ball. Well, Jeffy, you better get started on your homework, because it's a lot of homework. <laughs> I'm not doing that shit. I wouldn't even do that shit if it was one page. Jeffy, maybe if I told you what I ordered for dinner, you'll get happy. What are we having for dinner? I ordered pizza. <gasps> pizza? You hear that, PP? We're getting pizza. Uh, 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 pizza, pizza. Uh, 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 Jeffy, pizza, Jeffy, pizza, stop, stop. Uh, hold, hold on, Jeffy. That must be the pizza. I'm going to get it, all right? All right, pay me. Ah. Oh, <sighs> thank you. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, hello? Hey there, you order a large pepperoni pizza? Uh, yeah, but why is it opened? Hmm? Why is the box opened? Oh, well, I got bored, so I started counting all the pepperonis. Okay, well, how many are there? Uh, 45. Well, actually 46, and then I ate one. Okay. Uh, that'll be 9.95. All right, well, here's $10. You can keep the change. Really? Five-cent tip? I drove all the way over here and counted all these pepperonis, and you're giving me a five-cent tip. Okay, well, one, I didn't ask you to count the pepperonis. Two, you ate one. And three, I gave you ten grand earlier when you were a doctor. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Okay, pay me. Ah. Here you go. Oh, girl. Ah! Oh, Jimmy, look what you did! Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, he's trying to prevent it. Oh, you know what, Jeffy? You know what you're eating for dinner since you want to ruin this pizza? Come with me. You're eating, you're eating green beans. Oh. All right, Jeffy. Since you want to scare me and make me drop the pizza, you can eat green beans for dinner. Daddy, I already told you. I was trying to stop it from happening. No, you weren't, Jeffy. You came up behind me and scared me on purpose. So you're going to eat green beans. Aww. All right, Jeffy, open wide. <gasps> that makes sense. All right, Jeffy, open wide. <laughs> Jeffy, why would you do that? That's it, Jeffy. You want to throw your green beans? Well, you're grounded for a week and you can't leave your room. Well, that's fun, day. I like my room. I'm just going to sit right here and play Fortnite. Fortnite? Well, you know what, Jeffy? I'm taking your TV, too. Oh, hell no, Daddy. Why don't you put the crack pipe down and let's talk about it like fucking adults? No, Jeffy, it's too late for talking. I'm taking your TV. How high are you? Daddy, give me my TV back! No, Jeffy, you're grounded. Get away! No, Daddy, you're gonna break it! I'm not gonna break it, Jeffy. I'm just taking it. No, Daddy, I'm trying to stop it from being broken! No, I'm not gonna break it, Jeffy. Oh, no, Daddy! Let go, let go, let go! Let go, let go. No. Look what you did, Jeffy! Daddy, this is your fault! I was trying to stop it from breaking! So you know what? I'm calling the cops on you, Jeffy, because you need to be taught a lesson, Griff! Hey there, you called the police? Yes, I did, officer. My son's been a very bad boy. He broke his TV, and then he threw his plate of green beans at dinner. Now, what do you want me to do about it? I would like you to give him a talking to. A talking to? Yes. I'm a police officer. I arrest people. I don't do talking to's. You're his father. You're supposed to punish him, ground him or something. Well, he doesn't listen to me, so I thought he'd listen to a police officer. What? Okay. Hey, kid, you know that thing you did that you weren't supposed to do? Don't do it anymore. There, I talked to him. <gasps> you know, you've been wasting my time a lot today. First I came here as a doctor for no reason, and then I came here as a pizza man, and you just threw the pizza on the floor, so that was a waste of my time. And now that I come here as a cop, you want me to discipline your kid for you. You know what? You should be banned from using emergency services. Oh, Daddy. What? He's gonna shoot you in your leg. He's not gonna shoot me in my leg, Jeff. He's a police officer. He wouldn't do that. What? What are you doing? There's a fly in here, and I'm gonna shoot it. I hate flies. <laughs> Oh, there he is. Stop it! You're not gonna get him! I'm gonna get him, don't worry. What? There, there, there he is, there he is. What? Stop it! Uh, not quite. Uh, uh, what? what? Uh, uh, okay, okay, just hold still. No, no, no. Uh, oh, Daddy Glass! Oh, Feather Dick, goddammit! I got his ass! Oh, Daddy, I told you that was gonna happen! 
leg! Oh, I got your leg, too. Oh, God, why would you do that? Sorry, I'll, I'll go get my doctor outfit on. Oh, God. There you go. You're all bandaged up. I can't believe you shot me in the leg. Sorry, I just really hate flies. And Jeffy, you predicted that he would shoot me in the leg before it even happened. Oh, come on. I shoot lots of unarmed people. He probably just saw it on the news. Well, that's what I've been trying to tell you, Danny. I've been seeing things before they happen all day. Oh, yeah? Well, then what are the lottery numbers tonight? Well, I can't pick one I see. It just happens. Oh, yeah, that sounds real believable. Well, I mean, all day he's been saying he's been seeing stuff before they even happen. All right, stand back. <gasps> I don't know. I don't think anybody can predict the future. Because if they could, they should have warned me not to marry my ex-wife because she was a bitch. Is that a bat in your house? A bat? There's a bat in your house! How'd a bat get in my house? I don't know, but I have the perfect thing for this. This is my bat that I use to kill bats. It's my bat bat. I use it to bat bad bats. Not good bats. I only bat bad bats with my bat bat. You see all that blood? That's all the blood from the bad bats that I batted with my bat bat. Alright, I'm gonna go kill this bad bat. Alright, stand back. Ugh. Oh, my bad. Well, Jeffy, are you okay? <laughs> Jeffy, are you okay? Doctor, can you check and see if he's okay? Okay. Hey, kid, are you bleeding? No. Do you have any broken bones? No. Are you in any pain at all? No. Okay, well, in that case, here is another bill for $10,000 for wasting my time. And you can pay me right now. I got donuts! Oh, thanks, baby. Um, mommy, why are donuts? They're good, Jeffy. Well, of course you would say nuts are good, you're a girl. Well, Jeffy, don't say that. They have nothing to do with nuts. Then why are they called donuts? What? I don't know. Are they made out of nuts? No. Are they made out of dough? Yeah, like 100% dough. Okay, so then where did the nuts come in at? Did the chef rub his nuts all over well, them? Jeffy, don't say that. No, no one rubbed their nuts on them. Well, do they look like a nut sack? No. Well, then show me. Baby, show them. Okay, Jeffy, look. Look, 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 look what they look like. Danny, that looks nothing like a nut sack. See, I told you, it has nothing to do with nut sacks. It's, it's just dough. Look, look, call, call them dough circles. Well, I think they look like big Cheerios. Like, that's what they are. They're really big Cheerios, and they're really good. You should have some. Oh, okay, Danny, I'm going to give me a Big Cheerio. Which one do I want? Um, Danny, why is this Big Cheerio gold? What? Baby, did you order a golden donut? No, I don't know how that got in there. Why did we get a golden donut? Look, Marvin, let's watch TV. Hey there. Do you like donuts? If you do, go buy a box of donuts. And if you find the golden donut, you'll win a lifetime supply of free donuts. Go buy them now. Wow, we really just want a lifetime supply of donuts. We're going to get so fat, Marvin. Um, actually, I won the lifetime supply of donuts because I found the golden donut. But I bought them, Jeffy. But baby, don't argue. Look, we're not going to claim that prize because that's so unhealthy. We don't need a lifetime supply of donuts. You're right, Marvin. Well, then can I go claim the prize? No, Jeffy. Jeffy, we don't need a lifetime supply of donuts. That's so unhealthy. <sighs> oh, man, Danny. All right, well, if you need me, I'll be in my room just eating these donuts and not going to go claim the prize for a lifetime supply of donuts and become the donut king or anything. Yep, so if you need me, I'll be in my room, Danny. Okay, Jeffy. Hear ye, hear ye. I am the ruler of the donuts. I am the Donut King. Whoa, Jeffy, how'd you get so many donuts? Well, Junior, I found this golden donut, and I won a lifetime supply of donuts, and now every time I want some, they send me hundreds of them, because I'm the Donut King. Well, can I get a donut? No, Junior, I'm sorry, but if I give one to you, I'll have to give one to all the peasants. Oh, you, you just have hundreds of them, so I thought I could probably have one. Hmm. Well, how about this, Junior? If you want a donut from the King, something amazing you must bring. To trade. What, to trade? Yeah, you gotta trade me something cool for a donut. Uh, well, can I just give you money? No, I don't want money, Junior. I want something cool. Uh, what can I trade you for a donut? Um, ooh, I know, I, I got something. How about this? It's a megaphone. It makes you talk really loud. Give me a sip. Beep. All right, Junior, you got yourself a trade. You may pick out one donut. Yay, I get a donut! This thing is so PB. I feel so sick from eating donuts. I ate way too many donuts. See, that's exactly why we weren't going to claim the lifetime of supply of donuts, because they just make you feel so awful after you eat them. Ugh. <gasps> Look, Marvin, the news! Uh. Breaking news, okay? There's a worldwide donut shortage ever since this kid won a lifetime supply of donuts and requested that all of them be brought to his donut kingdom. <gasps> he didn't. Jeffy, we told you not to claim those donuts. Jeffy! Yes, father? We told you not to claim those donuts. Bow to the king. What? Bow to the king. I'm not bowing to you. 
No, Jeffy. Marvin, maybe we should just bow and get it over with. I'm not bowing to him. Danny, your shoe's untied. Thanks for bowing to the king. But I didn't bow to you. Mommy, your toes are untied. What? Wait, don't, don't. Thanks for bowing to the king. Oh, we did not bow to you, Jeffy. Look, we're getting rid of all these donuts. Danny, we can't get rid of my donuts because I'm the donut king and this is my donut kingdom. Jeffy, I told you not to claim those donuts. Danny, you don't get a lifetime supply of donuts and not claim them. Well, look, Jeffy, look, we're going to get rid of all these donuts right now, okay? Please leave the kingdom. I'm not, I'm not leaving. It's not a kingdom. Guard! Yes, my liege. I requested that they leave the donut kingdom, and they're not leaving. Leave the donut kingdom. It's not a kingdom, it's a bed full of donuts in my house. The king wants you to leave. He's not even a king, that's a Burger King crown. Look, leave or you'll be sorry. What are you gonna do about it, dolphin boy? Okay, that's racist, and if you don't leave, I'm gonna give you a tail whooping. A, a, a dolphin tail whooping. I'm gonna whoop you with my tail, is what I'm saying. <sighs> Baby, let's just get out of here. They're a bunch of bullies! Oh, look, look, look at that on the TV, Karen. There's a donut shortage, huh? How about that? No, Brady, I don't want to look at the TV. I just want to cuddle with you. It's cuddle time. Uh, yeah, that's great. Oh, Karen, my phone's ringing. No, buddy, you got to cuddle with me. It's cuddle time. It's cuddle time. It's answer the phone time, Karen. Get, get off of me. Get to answer the phone. Hello? Wait, wait really? Wait, the chief. Wait. Oh, my God. Okay, I'll be right over. Buddy, what's going on? It's the chief. He's dying. Oh, no. Chief! Chief, what's going on? I'm dying, guy. No, 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 don't, don't, don't say that! W what's wrong? Wong right here! Oh, Dr. Something Wong. W what is wrong? Wong a girl! W no, no, I mean, what's wrong with him? Oh, he dying! He dying real fast! He donut blood sugar be going and crash! He need donut! He need donut right now! What, really, sir? You need a donut? Yeah, guy. Whenever you become the chief of police, you have to have a donut every 24 hours or else you die. Oh no, but, but Chief, the donuts are sold out all over the world! Ever since that damn kid had to go and win that stupid contest! Well, guy, it looks like I'm gonna die then. Tell my wife I was cheating on her. No, no, sir! You're gonna tell her that yourself because you're gonna make it! You, you really think so, guy? I know so, sir! I'm gonna get a donut! Well, you better hurry, cause the heart rate monitor video only four minutes long. Uh, okay, okay, I'm gonna hurry right now, I'll go! Hurry up, damn it! Marvin? What? Ever since Jeffy kicked you out of Donut Kingdom, you've been angrily eating those baked beans. Yeah, I like baked beans. When I'm stressed out, I eat baked beans. It's my new thing. Every character's a thing. My new thing is baked beans. It's a little weird. No, every character has a favorite food. Like, you know, like Woody, like shrimp, and Shrek, like cheesecake. I, I like baked beans. That, that's my thing now. <laughs> There's someone at the door. Hold on. Uh, hello. Oh, hey, 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 is your son who won all the donuts here? Yeah, he's upstairs in his donut kingdom. His what? His donut kingdom. Ever since he won all those donuts, he made a kingdom in his room. Uh, okay, well, I really, really need one of those donuts. Well, so does everyone in the world. They made a line outside his room. What? Really? Yeah, there's a line. So if you want a donut, just go join the line. Okay. Oh, come on, this line is ridiculous! I know, tell me about it. I've been here for 45 minutes. What, 45 minutes? What? Hey, 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 Pooby. Hey, Pooby, let me skip you. What? No! Come on! Okay. Hey, hey, Logan. Logan, let, let me get in front of you. No! Oh, oh come on. Okay, okay, I can see why the movie never came out. Yeah, you guys were too busy waiting in line for donuts. Wait, is that Elena? El Elena! Can I get in front of you? No! Uh, the SML crew sucks! I'm just liking all your videos. Hey, hey, Pooby, how's your bum arm? Oh, ha, ha! Okay, this sucks. I'm gonna go talk to the guard. I've been in line for 30 minutes. What's taking so long? Sorry, ma'am. The Donut King is very busy. You'll just have to be patient. <sighs> okay. Coming through. Sorry, sorry. Oh, hey, no me. skipping. Oh, come on. You play like one character. Uh, I play two characters. I play your wife, Blighty. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Don't even start. Hey, man, no skipping. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm a cop. I'm, I'm an officer of the law. Don't you have like a donut line skip pass? No, no. You'll just have to wait in line like everybody else. What? Hey, what's that? Where? Nice try. All right, send the next one in. All right, next. Oh, me, 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 me. Hey! I said next. Hey, hey, I'm here, I'm here. I was next. Just don't ask anybody else. Okay, can I have a donut now? Bow to the king. What? what? Bow to the king. Oh, oh, yes, 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 your highness. Anything for a donut. Oh, okay, can I have one? If you want a donut from the king, something amazing you must bring. 
To trade. What, to trade? Yeah, you gotta trade me something for, for a donut. Well, okay, I have cash. Can I just give you that? No, I want something cool for a donut. But, uh, okay, I, look, look, man, I have a 20. How about I just give you a 20? No, you gotta trade me something cool. See, I got, like, this pocket bowling game. I got this megaphone. I got a flashlight and a stapler. You gotta trade me something cool if you want a donut. Okay, so just, like, junk? No, something cool. I don't... Okay, okay, look, man. My boss is dying, okay? And he, he if he doesn't get a donut, he's gonna die, all right? So I really... Bored! Do you not have a heart? Bored. What? I don't know what to get. Uh, you can have my hat. Do you want my hat? I'll give you my hat. No, I already have a crown that says Burger King. What? Okay, well, maybe my tie? I'll give you my whole outfit. No, you gotta trade me something or else leave the kingdom. Well, I don't have anything to trade. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't know what to get. Just give me a damn donut. Leave the kingdom. What? No, no, I need... Leave the kingdom. No, I'm gonna take a donut. Guard! Oh, oh, don't call him. He's Guard! already, he's already Hey, what's up, your highness? Kick him out of the kingdom. Oh, good. He skipped in line anyway. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. And stay out. I don't want to see your face in the donut kingdom ever again. Well, well fine. I, I don't want to be in this stupid donut kingdom anyway. It's stupid and dumb. I, I do really need a donut, though. Where am I going to get one? Oh, oh, Karen. She's not banned. Yeah, I'll just get her. Okay, okay, Karen. Here, take this. Go, go. Well, Winnie, I don't understand what you're trying to get me to do here. It's very simple, Karen. I just needed to take this Dig Dug machine into the Donut Kingdom and give it to the Donut King in exchange for a donut. But, Boyney, I don't understand why you don't just go to the store to get a donut! What, Karen, don't you think if it was that simple, I would have done it already? They're sold out everywhere. Haven't you seen the news? Boyney, I'm sorry that I'm not as obsessed with donuts as you are. I'm not obsessed with donuts, Karen. Hey, kitty. Oh, it's a Kit Kat! Oh, 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 oh. Boyney, this is crazy! Well, it's not crazy, Karen. Just go talk to the dolphin. Boyney, do you understand how ridiculous this sounds? Listen to what you're telling me to do. <gasps> you need me to talk to a dolphin to get to the Donut Kingdom to trade the Dig Dug machine for a donut from the Donut King to get to the doctor to give you a dying boss on his deathbed! Yes. Can you do it? Okay, Boyney, but this just sounds crazy! Okay, here, take it. Go. Oh, why is she taking so long? Hey, Boyney, I got your donut! Oh, Karen, you got the donut. Wait, wait. why is there a bite taken out of it? Oh, I got hungry on the way out. Uh, Karen, I guess, okay, I guess it doesn't matter. It's fine, but wait, wait where's your dress? Oh, uh, I really wanted to keep the Ding Dug machine, boy, day. <laughs> Good choice. All right, Karen, you got the donut. I can save my boss. He better hurry. Chief, Chief, I got the donut. Oh, you're too late. He died. No! All right, hold on. Let me just restart the video. Guy, <sighs> chief, chief, quick, eat the donut. Oh, guy, you saved my life. I'd do anything for you, sir. Ew. All right, Daddy, I gave away all my donuts. You gave away all your donuts? I sure did. So the donut kingdom is no more. What would you trade for all your donuts? Well, someone traded me a Ferrari for all my donuts. A Ferrari for all your donuts? Yep. Well, you know what? I'm glad. You don't need that many donuts anyway. Those are unhealthy. You need to eat something healthy like baked beans. Ew. What? Baby, look what I just found. I found the golden baked bean. You know what that means? Baked beans for the rest of my life. Oh, no. All hail the baked bean king. Who wants to trade me a Ferrari for all my baked beans? No. Hey, Dad, what you doing? Well, Jeff, I just got done cleaning up the attic, and I found an old box of stuff from when I grew up. You want to see? Yeah, Daddy, what's in the box? Uh, oh, look, my old Pac-Man machine. I used to play this for hours. I loved it. That's so cool, Daddy. Can I see it? Well, yeah, you can play with it. Do whatever you want with it. I can check this bitch. What? what? Daddy, do not throw my stuff. I'm sorry, Daddy. It's old and sentimental and stuff. It means something to me. Oh, oh look, my old guitar. I used to pick up so many women with this. That's so cool, Daddy. Can I see it? Yeah, I don't even know how to play it. What? Jeffy, I said you're not throw my stuff! I'm oh, sorry, Daddy, I forgot! I picked up women with that! Oh. Uh, oh, look! My old pencil girlfriend! One of the girls I picked up with my guitar, you know? Oh, can I see it, Daddy? No, I used to make out with her. You're not gonna touch her. No. Oh, look! My old joke toothpaste! Aw, oh, damn it, Daddy! You got toothpaste on the couch! What's well, a joke, Jeffy? It's not real. Oh. Oh, look! And my old, uh, my old teddy bear! I used to take him everywhere! I loved him! Oh, Daddy! Can I please see a teddy bear? He looks so cute! What? Well, no, Jeffy, I, I love it. He was my best friend. I, I don't want you to get him dirty or anything. Daddy, I won't get him dirty. I just want to see how soft he is. Yeah, look, you can hold him, but you oh, can't have him. Oh, Daddy, I love the bear so much. Can I please have him? No, he was my bear and he's my best friend and no one else can have him. No one can touch him. But Daddy, I love him so much. Can I please have the bear? 
Barry, please! Well, I mean, I am old, and I have no use for him, but he was my best friend. Please, Daddy? All right, fine, Jeffy. You can have the bear, but you, you better not lose him. Ah! Oh, thank you so much, Daddy! I love the Barry so much! Can me and Mr. Barry go to the park? Yeah, just don't get him dirty, and just please be safe with him. He was my best friend growing up. Yay! Let's go to the park, Mr. Barry! <sighs> Sometimes I just gotta grow up, you know? <laughs> All right, Mr. Barry, you ready to have fun in the park? Let's go! All right, Mr. Barry, you want to play hide and seek? I'll go hide and you can. Uh, Jeffy, uh, how long have you been standing there? Oh, not long, Dad. Just long enough to see you stick that pencil on your butt. Well, no, no, I didn't do that. I accidentally sat on it. Oh, I thought you were supposed to be at the park. Well, we were, Daddy. But, uh, but Barry told me something, so we came home early. Go ahead and tell him what you said, Barry. Oh, uh, Jeffy's a way better hunter than you are, Daddy. All you did was keep me in a box for years, and Jeffy took me to a park and got me ice cream and shit. Well, Jeffy, that's that's really nice that you did all that for Mr. Barry, but he had to go in the box because we were playing hide and seek for a very long time. But, yeah, so can you just leave me alone so I can have private time with a pencil? All right, Daddy, but real quick, can I take Mr. Barry to school? Yeah, you can do whatever you want with him. Just don't lose him or get him dirty or, 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 or destroy him, okay? Okay, Daddy. Come on, Mr. Barry. I'm going to show you to all my friends. Okay, where's that pencil at? All right, class. Today, we're going to be answering the question, why did the chicken cross the road? Very simple answer as to why chicken cross the road. Everyone knows the chicken crossed the road to get to the egg roll on the other side. Egg roll very delicious and the chicken knows it. Very delicious egg roll. <gasps> the chicken crossed the road to get to the egg roll. Did you hear that, Mr. Barry? <laughs> Are you talking to your teddy bear, you loser? Yeah, because I sure as hell ain't talking to you. <laughs> what, are you two years old? Who even brings their teddy bear to school? You can't leave your house without your teddy bear? My teddy bear is my best friend. So leave me alone. <laughs> Why? Because you don't have any real friends to hang out with? Oh, beat him up, Mr. Barry. <laughs> <laughs> you really think your teddy bear could beat me up? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Stop it! <laughs> Put him down! Leave him alone! No, he's my teddy bear now. Oh, teacher, this kid stole my bear! Ah, oh, Jeffy, why are you crying, real bitch? Buddy Bill, give your baby back your toys so he can stop crying. Uh, Alright, fine, here's your bear back, you little crybaby. <gasps> hey, everyone, he can't go to school without his little toy. <laughs> yeah, who brings a toy to school, you loser? Yeah, loser! Don't listen to him, Barry. One day you're gonna be real, and you're gonna prove him all wrong. <laughs> What happened, Jeffy? Well, people were making fun of me because I was talking to Mr. Barry. Well, Jeffy, people probably don't think it's normal for you to talk to a stuffed animal. But he's my best friend, Daddy. I know, he was my best friend, too, and I got made fun of when I took him to school. So, you know, how about you just go to bed and think about it? But it's 3.30 p.m., Daddy. Or you can just go to bed and let me have some private time. But it's 3.30 in the afternoon. I, I know, perfect time to go to bed. Everyone's tired at 3.30, right? Well, what about dinner? Uh... It's gonna be green beans. You can eat that? No. Well, they, there you go. You should go to bed because there's nothing you need to stay up for anyway. Oh. <laughs> oh, man, Mr. Barry. I wish you were real. Then you could be up that boy that made fun of us. Then you really know you were real. Well, let's go to sleep, Mr. Barry. Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Wake up. Anal. Jeffy, get up. It's time to go to school. <laughs> Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Just get up. <gasps> Where did my Barry go? Je Jeffy, did you lose my teddy bear? You said you wanted to sleep with it, but you, you can't find it? Oh, no, Daddy. He was laying right here. And now he's not here. Jeffy, you better not have lost my teddy bear. That was my teddy bear from when I grew up with it. Daddy, I don't know where he went. He must have ran away. Well, Jeffy, look. You have to go to school. We'll find him afterwards. But you better not have lost him. Come on. <laughs> Today, we're going to be learning about hibernation. Hibernation is when bears eat too much food at Chinese buffet and you have to kick his ass out. 
$9.99 doesn't give you the whole buffet. It only gives you two plates. And then they want to turn around and sleep for six months to let food digest. No. So the moral of the story here is, kids, is that bear no longer allowed a tiny buffet. It make us go bankrupt. <sighs> hey, loser. Where's your teddy bear? I don't see it. Is it doing hibernation like the teacher said? No. He ran away. Teddy bears can't run away, retard. They're not alive. Oh, <gasps> Barry, you came back? What? What? Wait, 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 Barry, talk and cheat. Break that ass, Barry, go. Oh, that's a big bitch. You trying to get more than two plates? Huh? You leave. You leave. You're not welcome in classroom or buffet. You leave. Choo, choo. Oh, Barry, I love you so much. Let's get out of here. All right, Mr. Barry, you want to go to the park? So much fun! You wanna go play hide and seek? Yay! <laughs> well, I'm gonna go hide. You count. Oh my God! Is that a bear in a park playing hide and seek with children? This is dangerous. I gotta go alert the news. Breaking news, you guy! A bear is running loose at a children's park. Let's cut to our live helicopter feed now. Oh my God! What you're watching is live footage of a bear trying to eat children at a park. He can smell the blood! This is Winnie the Pooh, and he's looking for his honey. And his honey is children's blood. It now appears that he has settled for a toucan. Oh my god, if you have small children, turn them away now, as he is violating this toucan. And it also appears that we have some onlookers videotaping and laughing. Wow. What a disgrace. This is no laughing matter. I'm getting word now that police are on the scene and are going to attempt to stop this bear. Oh man, Mr. Barry, you found me! Oh my god, that bear's about to attack that child. It's a good thing I brought my gun that's just painted to look like a Nerf gun just so I could shoot it in the playground, even though it's a very real gun that fires real bullets that definitely will kill him, because it's a real gun and not a Nerf gun. Get away from that kid, you son of a bitch! Bang! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's coming at me. <laughs> Stay away! Stay away! Bang! What? I got him! I actually got him! Daddy! Jeffy! I broke my pencil! <laughs> my teddy bear got shot! Wait, wait what? We'll turn on the news and find out! Well, okay. <laughs> Breaking news, okay? Police have shot and killed the bear that was running around the children's park. Here's Officer Brooklyn T. Guy with a statement. Hello everybody, uh, my name is Brooklyn T. Guy. I am the officer that shot and killed this bear. Uh, at the time of the attack, we thought it was a real bear, but after we get it back to the station and cut it open, we realized it's, it's just a teddy bear. It's a big old stuffed animal. Uh, we thought maybe there was a person in there, but no, no nothing. It's, it's just a big old, big old living teddy bear that was that was brought to life as if by a child's wish and nothing else. So, uh, it's dead now. So, um, oops. See, Daddy, look! Well, this doesn't make any sense! He wasn't alive, he's just a teddy bear! He was alive, Daddy! He was running around and we were playing at the park! Well, this doesn't make any sense, Jeffy! What? Oh, hold on, let me go into the door. Let me see what that is. Uh, hello? Hey there, uh, I'm the cop that shot your son's living teddy bear, and I just wanted to bring you his corpse in case your son still wants to play with him. I, normally that would sound really bad, but he's just a stuffed animal, and now that I'm looking at him, I, I probably should have known that he was a stuffed animal, not a real bear, but I was feeling really trigger happy and it just felt good to shoot something. But anyway, I, I just came to apologize, so uh, here's my apology. Alright, I've, I've never been very good at apologies. Uh, bye. <laughs> Jeffy, I got your teddy bear back. Oh, I liked him better when he was alive. Well, Jeffy, teddy bears aren't supposed to be alive. I mean, when I was younger, I wish he was alive, but look, now you have a huge teddy bear, and bigger is always better. That's what she said. Oh, I guess so, Daddy. Well, look, just grab him and go lay down with him. Look, you can lay on him like this. Look, you can make teddy bear angels. <laughs> and just pick him up and go back to your room. 
Oh man, Barry, why'd you have to get shot? <sighs> I wish you were alive again. Oh. <laughs> Where'd your stupid giant bear? He died. <laughs> he deserved it. Barry, you're alive? Oh no. <laughs> about supply and demand. Supply and demand is a very crucial part of business. Let me give you an example. Today, I was on my way to Crass and I stopped by the egg roll store to get some egg rolls. I ordered 10 egg rolls and they only had one egg roll. So their supply did not meet the demand. So I go outside and I start writing. We want egg rolls. We want egg rolls. Say it with me, Cross. We want egg rolls. We, we want, want egg rolls. We want want egg rolls. Oh man, those egg rolls are making me hungry. Good thing I brought Doritos. Hey, Junior, can I have those chips? I forgot my lunch and I'm really hungry. Can you have these chips? If you want them, you gotta work for them, baby girl. Give me them lips for these chips. Ew, no, Junior. Let me suck on them toes for these Doritos. Junior, gross. Get on your knees for this nacho cheese. Oh my God, how about I give you five dollars for the chips? What, five dollars for these chips? Yeah? They're not made of gold, but sure. Go get them. Oh, you're such a jerk! Oh my god, I made five dollars off of chips, and I still have a candy bar I can eat. Oh man, I can't wait to eat my chocolate bar. <gasps> Did you say chocolate bar? Yeah. Dude, you know I love chocolate. Ooh, I'll give you a dollar for it. A dollar? Yeah! Okay. <laughs> Go get it. What you do? I just made six dollars off of snacks, and I still have Skittles I can eat. Oh man, I can't wait to taste the rainbow. Ooh, are those Skittles? Yeah? Well, if anybody's gonna taste the rainbow, it's me and Ken. We're nothing but rainbow. I'll give you a dollar for them. A dollar? Yeah. Okay. Uh, can you hand them to me instead of just like throwing them on the floor like you did last time? Go get it. What? Okay. I, I just made seven dollars in an hour. That's more than minimum wage. I'm gonna become the snack dealer. Ooh, he said it. He said the title. Oh man, I can't wait to grab more snacks to make more money at school. <laughs> Chef Pee, what is this? A box of blueberry muffins? Wrong! It's an empty box of blueberry muffins. Okay. I need you to go buy more because we need more snacks. I don't have any money, Junior. Just go and ask your dad. <sighs> hey, uh, dad? <sighs> what do you want, Junior? I'm trying to watch TV. Well, we ran out of snacks in the pantry, and I was wondering if you could go to the store and buy more snacks. No, I'm not buying any more snacks. Look, I don't have any money. But you don't have any money? Well, then how do you pay the light bills and stuff? I, I know you have money. Can you just go buy more snacks? I'm not buying any more snacks, Junior, and you better not touch my snacks either. What, your snacks? Yeah, my snacks. They're in my snack drawer. I have a secret snack drawer. Open that drawer over there. Okay. That's my secret snack drawer. You better not touch any of my candy. Ooh, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> all right, guys, I got some more snacks. Junior, where are you getting all these snacks from? Where's your face getting all those pimples from? Where, okay. Look, it's from my dad's snack stash. Do you want anything? Well, does he know you're selling them? <sighs> does your mom know she's overweight? Okay. Look, what do you want? Well, those sour Skittles look pretty good. I'll give you a dollar for them. A pleasure doing business with you, Cody. Uh, why? Go get them. Uh, Joseph, you want anything? Oh, dude, is that a pop tart? It sure is. What flavor is it? Uh, whatever one you'll buy. Strawberry? It, it, it's definitely strawberry. Oh, you know I love strawberry, dude. All right, pleasure doing business with you. Go get it. Come on, I was about to get it. Hey, Penelope, you see anything you want on this desk? No, Junior, I brought my lunch today. Wait, you brought your lunch? What'd you bring? Carrot sticks and hummus. That sounds gross. You sound like you need some blueberry muffins or some Starburst. I'm trying to be healthy, Junior. Oh, when you're 40 years old, you're gonna be fat, ugly, and divorced anyway. What's it matter? Hmm, you're right. What, is that a dollar? Yeah. You gave me $5 yesterday. They paid a dollar. Well, those are the homies. That's homie pricing. Bros before hoes. And you're definitely the second word. Ugh. What, before? Here. What? Okay, yeah. Throw in a Starburst. Oh, you're killing me, Mommy. Look. Go get them. <gasps> Junior, you're gonna lose customers if you keep throwing everyone's food on the floor. Me, 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 me. Okay. I already made seven dollars. Exactly what I made yesterday. Oh, I can make more. Hey, Jeffy, you want any snacks? Snacks? I don't like snacks. What you got? I have Cheetos and zebra cakes. Oh, I'll do the Cheetos. Give me a dollar. All right. There you go. Pleasure doing business with you, Jeffy. Go get them. Where'd you do that? Hey, Junior, I'll take those zebra cakes for a dollar. All right, give me the dollar. All right. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, I dropped them. Go, go, go get them. 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. I made nine dollars today. Business is good. All right, guys, I'll be back tomorrow with more snacks. This was not strawberry, dude. No returns. All right, guys, I went to the store, and using the money I made from the last few days, I bought a bunch of snacks. So I got the supply. Now where's the demand? <laughs> Junior, are those nerds? Uh, yeah, they are, Cody. Uh, it's a candy named after you. Okay, Junior, I'm insulted, but here's a dollar. I want them. Okay. Now, could you please just hand them to me? God damn it. Does anybody else want anything? All right, Crass, I am pissed. Why am I so pissed off? Because yesterday, after Crass, I was walking around the room, and I find this. And I know what you're thinking. What is this? It's trash from someone eating in Crass. And now there's ants and shit running around the craft room, so now I have a new rule. No eating in crafts! And if I catch you eating in crafts, you're gonna be suspended! No questions! What? Looks like you're out of business, Junior. Oh, dude, I really wanted a candy bar! I really wanted Cool Ranch Doritos! Guys, 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 I'm not out of business. We just, we have to, we have to be really sneaky, right? So, so if you eat your food, you just eat it in your desk and, and throw your trash away, okay? So, so what, what do you want? Oh, I want a Snickers, dude. Okay, you want Cool Ranch Doritos? Yeah. <laughs> I want to die, I put my money in the grave. I really got to put a couple Snickers in your place. All right, guys, um, don't get caught with your snacks, and uh, you know, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys, I got more snacks. What do you want? You're not even trying to hide it, are you, Junior? Well, look, the teacher's not in the classroom yet, so I'm trying to sell it before class. What do you want? Ooh, I want a cosmic brownie. Okay. Is that a Reese's I smell? Uh, yeah, I have Reese's. Ooh, I'll take a honey bun between your buns, Junior. All right, I'll get it for everyone. All right, did everybody get what they wanted? Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude. I wanted this between your butt cheeks in case that wasn't clear. I am so pissed off. I'm more pissed off today than I ever been pissed off in my life. Yesterday, after saying no eating in crafts, I find this, which means someone named crafts. So I had no choice but to hire a snack police. Get in here. Hey there, I'm the snack police. I mean, I'm actually a real cop, but I'm just here to crack down on snack. I don't want to see anybody eating snacks in class. Snack is whack. Yeah, and if we find you eating snack in class, we're going to charge you with possession of snacks. And maybe even intention to distribute if I have probable cause. Yes, so don't let us find you having any snacks in your possession. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh, 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 no. You give me all your snacks, dear? So, do you have any possible suspects? Hmm. I have some idea. Excuse me, sir. Shut up. Well, I couldn't help but notice all the snacks on your desk. They're not mine. Oh, yeah, that's what they all say. No, my friend gave them to me. Oh, yeah? Who's your friend? I ain't no snitch. All right. Well, I'm going to have to arrest you for possession of snacks, especially because the board says no eating in class. But I'm not eating them in class. I haven't even opened anything. Hmm, you got me. He got me. Y you know what? Change the board to say no snacks in class. All right, now I'm going to arrest you for possession of snacks. Well, that's not fair, because the board says no eating, and I'm not eating. The teacher hasn't even said no snacks in class, and I already brought them into class. Hmm, you're good. You should be a lawyer. But I'm still going to arrest you for intention to distribute, because there's no way you're going to eat all these by yourself. All right. That's okay. I ain't scared of nothing. I ain't scared to drop the soap. Whoa, Junior, Jeffy just got arrested. But he's a real one. He didn't snitch. Dealing on the streets are hard. Dude, what are you going to do? You lost all your pride. I'll get more. We just have to be more sneaky. Just don't get caught. I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, guys, I got a new plan. I'm gonna sell the snacks out of my backpack so we don't get caught. What do you want, Cody? No, it's okay, Junior. I already bought a snack. You already bought a snack? From who? From the new dealer. New dealer? He's so hot. You bought a snack from him, too? Yeah. Oh, man. I wish I was at Three Musketeers. But who's the new dealer? What's up, Junior? <laughs> Lil T, what are you doing here? Oh, man, I'm selling snacks at school and I'm making a killing! Woohoo! What, uh. What you think you're doing? I'm doing my thing. What you think you're doing? I'm selling my snacks, trying to make a living. So you better get stepping, because it's my block. Nah, nah, nah. This is my block. I've been moving a lot of product over here. So this is mine. See, I've been selling I've been selling snacks on this block for days now. You just can't come up here and ruin our homie's business. Oh, okay, okay. What snacks you sold today? Well, I haven't sold any today, because Chef Peepy woke up late and he had to brush his teeth. We got stuck in traffic, so you got here early. Oh, okay. <laughs> early bird gets the worm. Unless the bird gets shot. What you trying to say? What you trying to say? I'm trying to say my snacks are better. Oh, no. No, no, no. My snacks! Smile back! Snicker! What? Uh, you trying to go to war, huh? Oh, yeah, we can go to war! If you're feeling froggy, then leave. Whip it, whip it! Ooh, okay. All right, crap! 
So we changed the board to say no snacks in class, cause apparently there was some confusion yesterday. Yeah, we made an arrest yesterday too, and we're pretty sure it was the snack kingpin. So hopefully there's not gonna be any more snack dealing going on. But don't try anything, cause I got eyes like a bat. You better not snitch. Oh, I don't snitch. I just murk fools. Oh, good luck with that fool. Oh, okay, yeah, we'll see about that. <sighs> I'm gonna kill him. Junior, it's just snacks. No, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna shoot him! No, Junior, don't shoot him! Don't throw your life away over snacks! You don't understand, Cody. This is my life now. I'm married to the streets. Man, I got so much money! I'm about to Abraham Lincoln this fool. Oh! Ah, you shot him! Why did you shoot him? What's wrong with you? I'm crazy! You guys better not snitch on me, or you'll be next! I think I'm... Oh my god! Oh my god, okay? So stay with me, you're gonna be okay! I got shot, man! Who, who shot you? It was! Yeah? It was! Yeah? I ain't no snitch. <laughs> no! Snitches get snitches! I'm gonna find out who shot you, and I'm gonna avenge you, I promise! <sighs> Alright, that's it! Who did it? Huh? Huh? Alright, I'm gonna search every desk and every backpack until I find the weapon! Who oh, no! Hey, you, kid, let me search your backpack! Uh, why? Because I want to know what's in it! It's just a bunch of school stuff. Alright, then show me. Okay. Let me just reach into my backpack! You don't want to do this, kid! I have nothing to live for! Well, neither do I! I got an ugly wife, I got 60 jobs, I don't care if I die, go ahead and shoot me! Pull the trigger, I'm not scared! Come on, watch! Look, do it! Pull the trigger! Pull the trigger, Brian, I don't care! Look, I'll do it for you! I can't do it! Yeah, I know, because you don't have the guts. And to be honest, neither did I. I, I was scared beyond belief there. I, I can't actually believe I did that. I'm a badass! Oh, well, look! I didn't, I didn't mean for it to get this far! I was just trying to sell some candy! I know. I know, kid. It's okay. We're gonna get you some help. Come on. <laughs> hey, Junior. What kind of punishment did they give you? Yeah, dude. They suspended me for three days. <gasps> oh, Junior, they really threw the book at you. Yeah, it's gonna be on my permanent record for life. Oh, colleges aren't gonna like that. Yeah, my dad's really mad. Where are you guys gonna get your snacks at now? I'm trying to quit this stuff. Yeah, me too, dude. <sighs> my stomach hurts. Hey, Joseph. I'm gonna fart in Cody's face. Oh, dude, dude. It's gonna be so gross. Hey, Cody. Yeah? <laughs> Ah, mm, 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 that's good. That's a good toot. Ugh, Joseph, I'm bored. Yeah, me too, dude. <laughs> guys, guys, look what I got. Oh, no, Joseph, you got a teddy bear. Wow, you got a teddy bear to replace your stupid doll? No, no, I still have Ken. Wow, he has two of them now, a doll and a teddy bear. These two? Well, guys, do you know what this is? A teddy bear? A blue one? It's not just any teddy bear, it's a star belly. So, what's that do? Well, what's it do? What's it do? Junior, turn off the lights and I'll show you what it does. Well, are you gonna mess with my butt? No, not this time. Okay, let me turn off the lights. All right, Cody, I turned off the lights. All right, guys. Are you ready to see into another galaxy? It's just a teddy bear, Cody. Junior, I don't think you understand. What you're about to see, not that many people have seen and survived. You're about to travel across space at the speed of light. No way, dude. Yeah, you're bluffing, Cody. Hey, right, guys, are you ready? It can't be that great, Cody. It's just a... <laughs> Oh, Cody! Oh my god! Now isn't it incredible? It's like the universe is on my ceiling! The coolest thing ever! Junior, it just busted a hole through your roof! We're looking into space right now! That is so cool! Like, who oh, I don't want to ask for that! Oh, dude, wait, where's this line coming from? No, Joseph, don't look directly! <laughs> Oh, Junior, I can't move. It's too beautiful. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What we need to do is we have to kick the teddy bear off the couch. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I was trapped in the spell of it. Okay, let me call a doctor. It's okay, oh, Joseph. Oh, God. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Yeah, doctor. We think my friend went blind. Oh, how'd that happen? Did he look at my ugly wife? No, he looked inside that star belly. I said, I said, I said, I said, I said, the star belly? Oh my god, those things are dangerous. They have the power of like a thousand suns inside of them. I mean, like, looking inside of one of those is like taking your eyeball out and throwing it directly into the sun. Times a thousand. Uh, uh, like, like, where did you even find one of those? Yeah, I got it on the black market. Oh yeah, I shop there all the time for like organs, for transplants and stuff. Well, if Joseph looked inside, is he blind? Oh yeah, if he looked in there, he's definitely blind. Well, can I get an eye transplant? Oh yeah, sure, that'd be easy. Yeah, that'll just be, hold on, let me figure out the price. Um, a million, billion, gazillion, cotillion, jillion, bedillion, zillion dollars. Well, we only have half a gazillion, billion, gazillion dollars. Well, sorry kid, that's just not gonna cut it. Have fun being blind, loser. Well, Joseph, I guess you're gonna be blind for the rest of- Ha ha! 
can't see. Hey, hey kid, hey kid, guess which letter of the alphabet you can't. What? C, he can't see. <laughs> you get it? Because he's blind, loser. Who is that? Anyway, Joseph, it looks like you'll be blind for the rest of your life. Dude, I'd give my show so I could see again. <laughs> Did someone say so? Ah, the devil! <laughs> yes, thank you, CJ. I got this. Wait, who's that? Oh, well, it is bring your son to hell day. So this is my son, Craig Jr., but he goes by CJ. Yeah, my name is CJ. Well, what are you doing here? Oh, well, I heard your friend say that he would sell his soul to get his vision back. Well, you already took his soul. Yeah, you took my show when you gave me my new shell. Oh, that's right, I did. Oh, never mind. Come on, CJ. No, I don't want to go. I want to stay here and play toys with my friends. Y you want to stay here with these losers? Yeah, I want to play toys. Hmm. Okay, I have a deal for you. I am very busy in hell with a lot of paperwork. So if you could just watch Craig Jr. for a little while, I will give you your friend's vision back. Watch your son. But I'm so busy today. Yeah, me too. Guys! <sighs> okay, fine. We'll watch him. Great, then we have a deal. I'll be back in 24 hours to pick him up. So I guess we're watching the devil's son. Dude, I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. Ah, this door won't open! Uh, Joseph, wrong way. Uh, oh, oh, okay, do that it. way. Thank you. Ow! Oh. So, CJ, what do you want to do? I want to start a fire. Where'd he poof to, Junior? He can poof? Well, of course he can poof. He's the devil's son. Of course he knows how to poof. Oh, he can be anyway. He's going to start a fire. Mm -mm -mm. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, the taste you can see. Thank <laughs> you, Bible. Thank you, a Fire. Fire. Wait, Shut baby, your hat's on fire! What? Shut <laughs> <laughs> baby, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. What was that? <laughs> bye, 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 fire. CJ, why'd you like Shut baby's hat on fire? Yeah, <laughs> fire. Give me that. Stop doing evil stuff. Junior, it's the devil's son. I don't know what you expect him to do. Boink stuff. He poofed. Where'd he poofed to this time? Oh, where'd he poofed to, Daddy? I don't know, Daddy. <laughs> Oh man, oh man, I can't wait to watch Charlie and Friends! It's my favorite show ever! <laughs> Time for Charlie, who likes Charlie, we like Charlie, everybody hey, loves hey. Charlie, we got Charlie, where is Charlie there? Hey, where are you going with my TV? Get back here! Yeah. <laughs> my TV! Why would you do that? Babu, bap, bap, babu. <laughs> Dad, what happened to your TV? Where'd it go? That little red thing threw my TV off the balcony! Oh, CJ won't stop doing evil stuff! Junior, it's the devil's son. I don't know what you want him to do. Oh, we have to stop CJ before he breaks more stuff! Wait, who's CJ? 1800, 1900, 2000. Baby, I finally have enough to pay my house payment on time! I'm so proud of you, Mario! Poof. P poof? Yeah, give me a mic. What? Hey! Come back here! Bye! No! There's one at the door. It's Goodman. Let's put that fire out. Uh, hello. Hey, Mario. You called and told me that you had your house payment, so I came as fast as I could. So where is it? I don't have it anymore. How? How from the time that I left my mansion and got to your house, where did it go? Well, you see, like, this little mini devil, like, grabbed the money, and then he threw it in a pot of fire. What are you on, Mario? Well, I'm not on anything. You need to clean up and go to rehab. What do I'm telling the truth. Look, come here, look, I'm telling the truth. See, come and look, 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 the money's all burned. Why would you do that? I did not do that, the, the devil did. Uh, Mario, it looks like you made me money roni and cheese, and you burnt it. Well, no, I, I did not burn the money, it was an accident. Look, 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 is there, is there any way you can still accept the money? It's still intact a little bit. No, Mario, there's a million other things I'd rather accept than this burnt money. Like, I'd rather have a, a, a pimple on the inside of my butt crack, and every time I wipe, it just hurts a little bit, just to remind me that it's still there. Or I'd rather have an Applebee's gift card, and I don't even eat at Applebee's. <sighs> Where'd he go, Cody? Junior, he put a sewing needle in the Nerf bullet. Anyone who gets shot with that is gonna get seriously hurt. Oh, 
evil. We gotta stop him. I would rather stick my hand in a porta potty for a nickel. I would rather. What is that? Wait, what? Bow, bow, bow. What? Uh. What? Oh. Owie! I'm tired of you. Get him. Oh, don't get. I can't wait to dig into my nice, delicious, creamy cream cheesecake. Oh, it's going to be like a chocolate soft serve when it comes out. Oh, it's going to explode my bowels. All right, let's dig in. Oh, what happened to my cheesecake? Oh, oh come here, you. I'm going to get you. Oh, it was Shrek. What happened? That little red booger ate all my cheesecake. Say I'm out, Bidoon, 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 Bidoon. Oh, hey, Mr. Red Guy, what doing? Yeah, 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 yeah. You pop out, Bidoon, 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 Bidoon. We, we have to stop him. Cody, he keeps doing a lot of evil stuff. We have to stop him. Who, who's at the door? Uh, hello? Hey there, I got a pizza for a guy named Shrek. Oh, don't get it, that's me! Alright, let me show you what you're getting. Oh, okay. Boom, take a look at that. Oh, delicious. Yeah, I'm Uber Eats. I gotta show you the pizza so you know I didn't spit in it. Okay. So how's that look? Oh, it looks delicious. Yeah, I made that happen. I'm Uber Eats. I... That was rude. Don't get it! What did you do to my pizza? Oh, CJ! Bad! CJ, you need to stop. You're being too evil and hurting people. Yeah. I never stop. Oh, God, please help us. Hey, what do you want? I'm playing a game right now. God? Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm playing this plague game. Whatever I do in the game happens in real life. It's awesome. Well, well, well can you please stop that and, and tell CJ to stop being evil? <sighs> Fine. Hey, 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 CJ, stop it. I'm never going to stop. Mm. Well, I've done all I can. I'm going back to play my game. Uh, when's the devil coming back to pick up his son? <laughs> oh, thank God you're here! Oh, oh, don't say that. Oh, I'm here to pick up Craig Jr. How was he? Oh, he was so awful! Oh, really? He was so evil! Oh, well, what did he do? Well, first, he let Chevy B's hat on fire. Oh! And then, and then he threw my dad's TV off a balcony. Oh! And then he threw this guy's money into a fire. Oh! And then he knocked this guy's cheesecake on the ground. Oh, Craig Jr., is this true? Yes. Craig Jr., I'm so proud of you! What, you're proud of him? Yes, of course. He was too good before, so I'm so happy he learned how to be evil. Come on, Craig Jr., let's go steal candy from some orphans. Well, hey, but before you leave, you said you were going to give Joseph his vision back. Oh, yeah, right. The black, okay, okay, your eyes are fixed now. Oh, I can see again! <laughs> oh, yeah! Woo! All right, guys, now that we all can see again, well, all Joseph can see again, what do you want to do now? Oh, I know what we're going to do now. Get the lights, Junior. Okay. <laughs> all right, guys, are you ready to go back to space? Yup. All right. Whoa! Oh, my God, it's so amazing! <laughs> oh. Dude, I can't help myself, but I got to look at it again! <laughs> Oh man, these paper airplanes are gonna fly so far. Eh, oh, it's so cool. Hey there, what you doing? Oh my god, you're so cute. Oh, thank you, you're cute too. Oh, you wanna be my girlfriend? Uh, oh my gosh, what is that? Is that a bird or a plane? Oh no, it's just my friend Joseph. Hi, what's up, dude? What's up, Joseph? Look how far my paper airplane went. Oh, wow, you threw it really far. I threw it really far. Oh my gosh, is that your friend? He's so hot. Wait, Joseph? Joseph's not hot. He has wings. I wish I could fly. Oh, oh say less, baby. You can fly with me. <laughs> I could show you the world. Wait, Joseph, you can't just take my girl because you have wings. Oh, she only liked him because he has wings. Chef BB! Ooh, spicy! I love it! Hot! I can't control it! Get some more spices, baby! Chef BB! What do you want, you annoying brat? Well, there was this girl that was really cute, and I really liked her, and I wanted her to be my girlfriend, but then Joseph came along, and now she's his girlfriend! She probably doesn't want to be your girlfriend because you're ugly, and you wear a bib, and you cry all the time! No, 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 no! She didn't like me because Joseph came along, and Joseph has wings, so maybe if I had wings, she'd like me! Well, there's some wings over there. Have at it. Eat up. You know what? They're extra spicy, so she better like spicy wings, baby. Oh! Oh, wings. I mean, these aren't the wings she likes, but 
I mean, there are some kind of wings. I'm gonna try this. Baby, with these wings, I could fly you anywhere you wanna go. You wanna fly to Paris? I could fly you to Paris. You wanna go to China? I could fly you to China. Shoot, I could fly to the moon. The moon? Oh yeah, we could go to the moon, baby. Hey, baby, check these wings out. <laughs> She don't want them wings. She's talking about these wings. But, but, but these are hot and spicy. I don't like spicy food. I like to fly. Yeah. <laughs> so scram, Junior. She's with me. Let's fly to Paris, baby. And off we go to Paris. Oh, but these wings are good. <laughs> what am I going to do? Oh, I wish I had wings like Joseph. I'll never get wings. I'll just sit here and watch TV. <laughs> Squish. <laughs> Red Bull gives you wings. What? Red Bull gives you wings? I have to get some. I have to get some right now. <laughs> oh yeah, I definitely feel like I have wings. I have wings. Oh yeah, I can fly. I can fly. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna jump off the roof. I'm gonna jump off the roof. Okay, one more for good luck. <laughs> I drank a Red Bull, so it gave me wings! Dude, that's a commercial! They don't give you actual wings! Or well, maybe they're invisible wings! Oh, dude, dude, you better not jump! Please don't jump! Watch me fly, baby! <laughs> yeah! There you go, kid! You're all bandaged up! Alright, kid, I hope you learned your lesson. Don't believe everything you see on TV. Red Bull doesn't really give you wings. Next time, drink a monster instead, because it really turns you into a monster. Just ask my wife. Yeah, he gets really angry. Yeah, I'm trying to get help for it. I try to call the cops, but I can't because he has one! Yeah, that's right! Now you get home right now! Ah! Junior, what happened to the wings that you took? Oh, uh, I left them outside. Sorry, Chef Pee Pee. Junior, it took me forever to make those wings! Well, you don't have to get so angry about it. What, what, what? Well, he must have drank a monster. Man, I'm just so angry all the time. I want to hit something. Uh, I, I'm gonna hang up on him real quick. Yeah, do that, do that. Uh, sorry about that, Chef Pee Pee. Wait, Junior, what happened to your legs? Oh, I saw a Red Bull commercial and it said if you drink a Red Bull, you'll get wings. So I drank a bunch of Red Bulls and I jumped off the roof and I broke my legs. Junior, you're such an idiot. Why would you jump off the roof? Oh, it's a commercial. You won't get actual wings. Well, the Red Bull commercial said Red Bull gives you wings. So I drank a Red Bull. I, I thought it would give me wings and I could fly. Well, did you get your wings? No. Exactly. It's a commercial, you idiot. I should sue them for false advertising. Oh, you idiot. You can't sue them. Want to bet? All right, kid. So let me get this straight. You want to sue Red Bull because you didn't grow wings after you drank it? Yeah, see, I saw the commercial. It said Red Bull gives you wings. So I drank it because I thought I was going to grow wings. I'd be able to fly. But I didn't grow wings. I ended up falling and breaking both my legs. Hmm. Well, I've seen the commercial. And after watching the commercial, I would think it's just a silly cartoon, and I wouldn't believe what it said. Well, you see, if the word wings had three eyes in it, then I wouldn't believe it. But it's spelled perfectly as wings, so I want to sue them for false advertising, because I think I have a case. Okay, alright, well, let me see what I can do. <laughs> alright, kid, so I got you $10,000 for your settlement with Red Bull. And Red Bull has agreed to change their slogan from Red Bull gives you wings to Red Bull gives you wings. So the word wings is gonna have three eyes in it instead of one. Good, good. Hopefully nobody else will get hurt like I did. Yeah, so uh, what are you gonna spend the $10,000 on? I know, I'm gonna buy a Buzz Lightyear toy. All right, now that I bought this cool Buzz Lightyear toy, maybe he can teach me how to fly since he knows how to fly. All right, Buzz Lightyear, teach me how to fly. Go infinity and beyond. What? That's all I gotta say, it's to infinity and beyond? Okay, but, 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 uh, how do I take off? I mean, you have wings, right? Let me see. Go infinity and beyond! Okay, okay, I, I get it. I need to break the wings off this Buzz Lightyear toy, and then I'll be able to fly, as long as I say, to infinity and beyond! Yeah, I'm gonna break him off his back. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna fly! Daddy's gonna fly today! Hey, Joseph! Dude, is that Buzz Lightyear wings? Yeah, I'm gonna fly for real! To infinity and beyond! Ah! You gotta stop doing dangerous stuff, kid! I just wanted to fly like Buzz Lightyear did in Toy Story. He doesn't fly in Toy Story, you idiot. Didn't you see the movie? He falls down, then his arm breaks off. Karen, give me another monster. Okay, Boydie. I'm gonna sue Toy Story for making me try to imitate it and fly like Buzz Lightyear. Well, you can't sue Toy Story, kid. It's just a cartoon. Watch me. 
So let me get this straight, kid. You want to sue Pixar because you decided to imitate something that you saw in one of their movies? No, I want to sue Toy Story because I imitated something I saw in Toy Story. Well, Pixar created Toy Story, so you have to sue Pixar. Look, I just want to sue somebody because I got hurt trying to do something I saw in a movie, and I tried to fly like Buzz Lightyear did in the movie. Okay, well, if you want to fly like Buzz Lightyear, Buzz Lightyear also straps himself to a rocket, and he started flying. So if you wanted to fly, you should have just strapped yourself to a rocket. Yeah, that would work. I mean, I wouldn't have wings, but at least I would fly and the girl would think I was cool. All right, thanks for the idea. Okay, I got a bottle rocket. I'm gonna listen to my lawyer and strap myself to this because then I'll actually fly and then that girl will love me. All right, let's do it. Whoa, 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 let me get this straight. You want to sue me because I told you to strap yourself to a rocket and you actually did it? Well, you told me to do it, so I thought it was a good idea, but the rocket blew up and I blew up into a million pieces. Well, it's not my fault, you're an idiot. Well, I want to sue you for a billion dollars because you told me to do it. Well, I'm not paying you a billion dollars. Well, get back here, I'm just ahead. Aw, oh, what do I do? I don't have wings or a body. I guess I'm just going to go to bed. I guess I'll just go to sleep because I'll never get wings. Oh. And for the people wondering how I got my body back, this is a YouTube video. It's not real. Unless I invite Joe over for a sleepover, and then I break his wings with a hammer, and then he won't be able to fly, and then the girl will like me. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm going to go call Joseph. Oh, man, I can't wait for Joseph to get here. Because as soon as he gets here, we're going to go to sleep, and then I'm going to break his wings with this hammer so that he can't fly, and that girl will like me. Yeah. He's here, he's here. Hello? Oh dude, I'm sorry it took so long, but I had to drop her off at her house. <laughs> you know that ain't quick. <laughs> oh, hey, but first I had to take her to the drive-thru cause she was hungry. Uh, you know, people with wings, we call it the fly through. Can we just fly through the, you know what I'm saying? Yes. Wait, wait, what's wrong, dude? Uh, n nothing, uh, nothing. J just come inside, Joseph, let's have our sleepover. <gasps> oh yeah, sleepover! So dude, what's the first thing we're gonna do for this sleepover tonight? Ooh, play video games, have a pillow fight? Wait, what's this hammer for? Oh, uh, uh, th this hammer, I was, I was gonna, I was gonna break some stuff. Oh, what were you gonna break? Uh, it's not important. Uh, you wanna go to bed? Dude, I just got here. Yeah, you look tired. You're flying all night. Let's go to bed. I I'm not tired, dude. There you go, Joseph. Dude, I'm not even tired. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Oh, they always bite at my house. Wait, where are you going, dude? Oh, uh, I'm getting a glass of water. Oh, can you give me one, too? I am parched. Uh, no. I, I only have one cup left. What? And we only have enough water for me. Oh, God, dude. Good night. <sighs> Good night. <sighs> Whoa, Joseph, that's a crazy, insane nightmare. I, I can't believe your mind would even think of something that crazy. I know, dude, I know. But look, I'm going to go and stay tonight at her house so she can make me feel better, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I'll see you later, dude. No, Joseph, no. Oh, I'm supposed to break his wings. <sighs> oh, I guess I'll go for a long, lonely walk outside since I'll never get wings. <sighs> What's that? Oh. <gasps> A shooting star! Ooh, ooh, I gotta make a wish. Uh, I wish I had wings! Ooh, I have wings! It worked! I have wings! Take that, Joseph! Ooh, I can't wait to show Joseph in the morning. I can't wait to get that girl in the morning. Oh, yeah! Ooh. Hey, baby, check out my wings! <laughs> what, what's wrong, Joseph? Oh, it was an accident, dude! What, what, what happened? Oh, I was flying with her, and, and, and I dropped her! You dropped her? Oh, yeah! Uh, from, from how high? Oh, a thousand feet, man. A thousand feet? <laughs> Is she okay? I don't know. Look, I was flying with her. We were just trying to go so high, and a fly flew in my face, and I just dropped her. <laughs> well, well, I got these wings now. She was finally going to love me, and I have the wings now. Maybe, oh. maybe the lesson is that we shouldn't change our true selves for a girl. You're right, Joseph. A girl should like you for who you are. You shouldn't have to change for them. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, Joseph? What, dude? I'm never gonna let a girl get in between us again. Let's fly together. I, I believe, believe I can fly. fly. I believe I can touch this guy. Ding, 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 ding. Congratulations.
questions, Danny. You're now on the Jeffy Game Show. And if you answer this one question correctly, then you have to buy me the new PlayStation 5 and the new Xbox Series X. I don't want to play. Well, too bad, Daddy. The first question is, what color is my helmet? Red. No, you just changed your helmet. Nay, nah, nah. Mario, you said he had a red helmet on. Now he's wearing a red helmet. Well, no, it was blue and he just changed. It doesn't count. Well, Danny, I don't make the rules. I just follow them. Well, I'm not buying you the new PlayStation or the new Xbox. Just wait till Christmas. Christmas? That's like next month. I don't even know if I'll be alive by then. You'll be alive next month. I know. Mario, that's true. The sun could explode tomorrow. Yeah, and if the sun explodes, then I don't know what it's like to have a PlayStation 5 or a brand new Xbox. Box. Well, no one will know because if the sun explodes, we'll all be dead. So no one will care. Look, Jeffy, look. Christmas is next month and you have to be good because Santa Claus is watching. Oh, Santa Claus is watching? Well, what about this, Santa Claus? I got a big diaper full of Jeffy, Jeffy, that's it. You're grounded. Grounded? What did I do? Mario, how about we make him a good boy chart? What's a good boy chart? Here, look. Every time Jeffy does something good, we put a gold star on the chart. And when he has 25 gold stars, he gets a prize. G good idea, baby. He'll never do 25 good things, so he'll never get a prize. Mario, that's not the point. <laughs> Jeffy, look. Uh, we got you a good boy chart. Good boy chart? Yeah, good boy chart. If you do 25 good things, I'll buy you one of the new systems. 25 good things? I might as well just wait till Christmas. Then wait till Christmas. What no, Daddy? Tell me what the 25 good things are. Okay, you, you have to do good things like you can't be annoying, you can't poop your pants, ooh, and uh, you can't break stuff. Well, I haven't broken anything all day, so gold star. Oh, I'll go get the gold stars. What, no. All right, Jeffy, there's your first gold star. I got a star? Daddy, that is the tits. And you lost your gold star. I lost it? What did I do? You said a bad word. That's a bad word? Most people would say that's a good word. Jeffy, look, you can't say bad things. You can't do bad things. You can only do good things to get gold stars. Well, Daddy, my butt's mad at you. So you better gotta listen to what he's gotta say. <laughs> Jeffy, that is disgusting. Look, you can only do good things, so start doing good things. Okay, well, what good things do you want me to do then, Daddy? One, take the microphone out of your pants. Okay, next, go clean the entire kitchen, and you'll get a gold star. All right. Well, this might actually be a good thing if he starts doing good stuff. Yo, 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 Mario, what's up, folks? What's up, Black Yoshi? Yeah, man, I know you see that new PlayStation 5, you know the PS6 one? Yeah, I saw it. And the new Xbox. Yeah. Well, my pockets run a little thin this month, <sighs> so I was wondering if you'd be done slide me that Thowie so I can get the consoles. I don't have a Thowie. Owie! Look, Black Yoshi, I'm not going to buy you any of the systems because I have to buy Jeffy one if he finishes his good boy chart. Good boy chops? <laughs> what's that about, folks? Well, if Jeffy gets 25 gold stars, I told him I'd buy him one of the systems. Well, why don't I get some good boy chops? Because you just don't get one. Well, hold up, Owen. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Mario, take this out right here. This is my own good boy chops. And instead of 25 stars, I got 50 stars on there. Like the American flag. <laughs> I play the Libra to the good boy chops, to the United States, or give me both the consoles. Black Yoshi, what good things have you done? Uh, I be done checks the mail. What, uh, that, that's why my mail was stolen. Oh, yeah, your grandma be sent you $5 for your birthday, but I already be done spimps it. Like, that's a federal offense. Mario, I don't care what type of filth it is. If it's a picket fence, a huckleberry fence, the Miami doll fence. Look, you're not getting any of the systems. I don't care if you have a good boy chart. <laughs> well, fine then, folks. You green. I'm just going to take my chart somewhere else. Maybe I'll take it to Walmart, and they can see how good I've been. And maybe they just give me the console free. <sighs> Oh man, I don't want to clean all these dishes. Hey Jeffy, what are you doing? I'm about to have to clean the kitchen so I can get a gold star. What happens if you get a gold star? Well, I get to get all the new systems. Uh, really? Yeah. We want to see my new toy that I just got? Heck yeah, Junior. All right, turn off all the lights. All right. All right, Jeffy, check this out. It's a lightsaber. Junior, that is the tits. I know, right? It's a real lightsaber. So if I touch it, my fingers are gonna come off? Yeah. A liar. Well, you must be made out of armor or something. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I am the BFD with the BFD. Yeah, so what if instead of cleaning those dishes, you got rid of those dishes like a Sith? Oh, heck yeah, Junior, heck! Yeah, here, use your Jedi powers to clean those dishes. All right, Junior. All right, Jeffy, the dishes are all lined up for you. Dishes? I am your father. Yeah. 
You showed those dishes. Well, I sure did, Junior. Whoa, Jeffy, look at the big mess you made. I know, Junior, it's so sick. Ooh, you made a big old mess. Now I'm gonna go tell your daddy. Oh, please don't go tell my daddy. I'm supposed to be being a good boy and get the gold star so I can get the new systems. Well, hey, if you help me get the new PlayStation 5, then uh, I won't tell your daddy that you made a big old mess. So, this is what the plan going to be. So, what you going to do is, you going to go steal the gold stars and put it all over your good boy card. And then you going to take that card to your mama. You going to tell your mama that your daddy gave you the stars and then she going to buy you the Xbox. Then you take that same card and take it to your daddy. And then you tell your daddy that your mama gave you the stars. And then he going to buy you the PlayStation. And then you give the PlayStation to me. Oh, that idea sounds pee Well, wh when do I get a system? You don't. Aww. All right, so go steal the star and get a card to your mom. All right. Oh, my stomach's rumbling. I'm really hungry. Oh, me too. Hey, since Jeffy's cleaning the kitchen, I can go get us some food. Yeah, you should definitely go get us some food. Okay, well, what are you in the mood for? McDonald's. Definitely McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. We always get McDonald's. But I love McDonald's. And just don't tell Jeffy we're getting McDonald's because I don't want him to eat any of it. Why is that? Because I want him to eat healthy. Oh, well, okay. Well, I'll be right back then. All right. Oh, hey, Mommy. What is it, Jeffy? Oh, uh, before you leave, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Daddy gave me all the stars on my good boy <gasps> chart. He did! Jeffy, I'm so proud of you! Yeah, thanks, Mommy. Oh, uh, I am pretty proud of it. Uh, but when you go out, can you go ahead and get me my Xbox? I will, Jeffy! I will! Oh, sweet, Mommy. Thanks. Ooh, yeah, all oh, Daddy, guess what? what? Jeffy, why are you talking like that? Right there go good boy chart full of stars. Jeffy, stop talking like that. What are you saying? Well, Daddy, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Mommy go ahead and gave me all the stars. But she's not supposed to do that. She's only supposed to give you one star for cleaning the kitchen. Well, now you gotta go get me my PlayStation. Well, Jeffy, no, explain to me what each star was for. All right, well, the first star, because I cleaned one dish, then I cleaned two dishes, what? and then I cleaned three dishes, and then I clean four dishes. No, you don't. Then I clean five dishes. You don't get a star per all dish. All the way down to 25 dishes. Oh, oh, you know what, Jeffy? Fine. Listen, I will go ahead and buy you one game system, but only one. But on Christmas morning, when you wake up and there's no other presents, what are you going to think? That there's no Santa Claus? No, no, because I'm giving you a Christmas gift today. So when I give you your one game system right now, that means it's all you're getting for Christmas, okay? So wh which, which system do you want right now? Uh, the PlayStation 5. All right, I'm going to go get it, but that's all you're getting. Good. Oh, folks, it's working, folks! Uh-huh. Uh, uh. All right, Jeffy, here's your PlayStation 5. Daddy, this is cool as... T Jeffy, do not say that word. <laughs> Look, here, just take your PlayStation 5. Merry Christmas. And a happy new year. Jeffy, go! Take it. That is the bosoms. Thank you for being such a good boy, Jeffy. Oh, I'm the bestest boy ever. Enjoy. Thanks, mother. No, no, no. This ain't right. What's wrong? They went ahead and got us the digital dishes or the PS5 and the Xbox, so they went cheap on us. Is that bad? Yeah, it's bad. Because what happens if our Wi-Fi goes out? Then we can't access our games. So we need the ones with the disc dishes. So what we need to do is, I got some plan. We're going to go downstairs and we're going to break both of these consoles so they have to take it back and get us the better ones. So come on, let's go. All right, Jeffy. So what we're going to do is, we're going to break them and then you're going to take them back to your parents and tell them that they came like that. Then they're going to take them back to the store and then they're going to exchange them for the good ones. All right. All right, so I'm going to hit this egg bot with the helmet. All right, you ready? Here we go. <coughs> I got an even better idea. All right, folks, we're gonna throw the Xbox out the balcony. Here we go. <laughs> That's how I'll do it. All right, let me get the PlayStation. All right, right here. PlayStation 5 is next. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go check it out, folks. Oh, 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 yeah, folks. They broke it. So now what you gotta do is you gotta take them to your parents and then tell them they came like this. All right. Mario, I'm back. Oh, good. I'm starving. Where's the food? <gasps> Mario, I completely forgot. I was just so excited about Jeffy being such a good boy. I mean, he was a good boy, right? Yeah, right? I mean, he cleaned the kitchen, right? Yeah, right? Um, Mommy, uh, I need to talk to you in the other room in private. Oh. It's an emergency. Okay, Jeffy. 
All right. All right, mommy. So I was getting ready to play the Xbox, and I was so excited, and I opened up the box, and it looked like this. Oh, no, Jeffy, it's broken. Yeah, and I read online that all the digital Xboxes are broken. So when you take it back, I think you need to ask for the one with the disc because uh, those are stronger. Oh, Jeffy, I'm so sorry I got the wrong one. I'll go to the store right now, return it, and get the right one, okay? Oh, oh thank you so much, mommy. I appreciate it. Oh, Daddy! What? It's awful! What? Play the shot, old yeller! What are you talking about, Jeffy? Daddy, I was getting ready to play my new PS5. I was so excited. And I opened up the box and it was broken! What, broken? Yeah, and I read online that all the digital PS5s are broken when you open them up. Well, well, so then what am I supposed to get? Well, you're supposed to get the one with the disc player. I heard those are stronger and they don't break. And they're not broken when you when you get them. What, it looks like this thing just snapped back on. It doesn't. It, well, 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 let me try it. No, it doesn't. Let, let me try it. Okay, it was dropped off a balcony. What? I mean, it looks like it was dropped off a balcony. I don't know what they're doing over there at Sony. But. Uh, okay, well then, I'll try to... Okay, I'll return it and get you the one that can play disc if this one came broken. Okay. All right, thanks, Daddy. <sighs> Jeffy, I got your PlayStation 5. Jeffy, I got your Xbox. What? Baby, why'd you get him an Xbox? Why did you get him a PlayStation 5? He said you gave him 25 gold stars. He said you gave him 25 gold stars. I didn't. I didn't. Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa. Uh Oh! Uh, Jeffy, that's it! You're grounded! You lied to us! Father, please don't raise your voice at me. No, don't talk to me in that British voice. It's not gonna work this time. You lied to us so that you can get both systems. Well, only one of the systems is for me. Then who's the other system for? <laughs> oh, oh, you got the PS5! Oh, I can't wait to play it. No, you're not playing the PS5. We're gonna return these consoles. Jeffy, you're grounded. Well, am I grounded too, Daddy? Yeah, you're grounded too. You know what? Actually, I think I'm gonna play the PlayStation 5. Oh, I think I'm gonna play the Xbox. What? Yep, we're gonna play these systems because we bought them. And you guys can just sit back and watch and be grounded. Come on, baby, let's play these systems. Come on. <laughs> oh man, this PlayStation 5 is so fun. This is so much fun, Mario. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 